MrPopCulture.com, the Instant History Touch Keypad, 1955 through 2013. Click or touch any of these years and relive it vicariously. Let's go back to the year 2002, 2002, as we relive that year. And we scroll down, and you as a reader can go to each one of these timelines, touch or click, and go right to the source. It'll take you to January of each timeline. We're going to kind of read this like a book, so we're going to start from the top. Scroll down like a book and get into 2002. January of 2002, we see the big pop hit single, uh, you remind me, Nickelback. Also in the news, Fear Factor, the NBC summer hit, is back in January of 2002. Into the American Music Awards, Alicia Keys, a big winner, in February. U2 performed at the Super Bowl halftime show. In February 2002, Celine Dion being interviewed by Barbara Walters, Grammy Award winners, this is interesting, in March of uh, 2002, single sales totaled 31 million, down a whopping 41% since 2000, that's music news, that's a big, big trend. Top albums in March of 2002. Britney Spears making news in April of 2002. Another top pop hit music single right here. This would be late April of 2002. Remember, you can click on any one of these music videos. They're in timeline context, so this is when they were popular. And you can click those on, listen to the music as you scroll down. Ah, new show on Fox TV. American Idol. Search for a Superstar. Debuts in June of 2002. Your co-hosts Ryan Seacrest and Brian Dunkelman. Whatever happened to him? Into July of 2002 Entertainment News. And Kelly Clarkson looks like she's the first winner of American Idol. Looks like it's going to be back. Snoop Dogg in the news in September 2002. Looks like Madonna's got a new movie swept away in 2002. Jam Master J, part of uh, Run DMC, is shot and killed in October 2002. Faith Hill has a TV special in November 2002. Whitney Houston gets interviewed by Diane Sawyer. You can see it here on the Mr. Pop Culture 202 2002 rather timeline. And into the next timeline, which would be the year 2002 in news headlines. And we start the clock again in January. Your reading pleasure. And scroll through the news of 2002. Enron in the news. State of the Union. Through March. And the War on Terror into June of 2002. As we continue into August, ah, the DC snipers. Yeah. 
and they finally got them in October 2002. Into November and into December of 2002 in the news and timeline form. Mr. Pop Culture, let's go to the next timeline here, which would be technology in 2002, AOL in the, in the news, AOL. Napster relaunches. Apple unveils the new iMac G4 in February of 2002. Good old Netscape. And the fourth timeline of 2002, sports and other fascinating facts. Uh, the New England Patriots beat the Rams. Super Bowl 3-6. Into September. Series highlights. And the big movie that year, My Big Fat Greek Wedding. And the year 2002. Go to MrPopCulture.com and relive it all. Thanks for taking a look.